Hello magnificent guests! Just to make it clear, when you refresh the page, you lose all the data, not only your permissions. To save the data, you will need to use session storage or local storage. It's like a little database in your browser. The difference between session storage and local storage is the lifespan of the data. If we are talking about local storage, when you close the browser, this data is still there. If we are talking about session storage, unfortunately, when you close the tab or browser, you will lose all the data. Depending on your needs, you will need to choose between these two options. Let's look into our use case. We will have our login page. So when user enters his name and presses submit, he will be redirected to another page. In our case, it's about page. But here is the problem. When we press refresh the page, the data is lost and it's redirected to our denied page. So how we can fix it? Let's navigate to code. So uh, here we will have our uh, about component that is protected by Nginx permissions guard and it's only available to, our, to the user who has happy permissions. If he doesn't have, he will be redirected to our denied page. And in our login component, we will just have a form and when we submit this form we make a request to load permissions load permissions is just a step that will return a promise with a array and with happy permission we will take these permissions and load our nginx permission service and uh, navigate to our about page so uh, to preserve the data, first what we will do, we will use local storage. So we will type local storage and here we have set item. Set item takes a key and a value. Key should be unique because it can override with other, it can clash. So we will use app nginx permissions. And value should be a string, but what we get from load permissions is actually an array so we need to transform our uh, array to string we can use json stringify and pass our data after that uh, we navigate to app routing module and as you can see uh, ausgard is protecting everything and we should uh, load permissions in our OSGuard. So how we can do it? I've already imported our NGX permission service to load permissions. First, we will get our permissions. So we will type const permissions and say local storage get item and pass our unique key that we have in our uh, login component. So it's app ngx permissions. Then we can type if we have permissions, we will load them. So uh, this ngx permission service load permissions. And because we are from the local storage, we are getting uh, string, we need to transform back the string to our array we can use json yeah not j json parse and we pass our permissions let's check what we have so first uh, we navigate to our login we pass something submit we navigate to our about page refresh the page and as you can see it's we we are still staying on the page and let's try if we open new window and pass the data is still persistent even across uh, new window now let's check uh, session storage because it's a little bit different to change it uh, it's quite easy they use the same api the only thing that we need to do is change from local storage to session storage. And in our login component also. Uh, 
let's see different behavior. So now we navigate to our login page. Yeah, in about everything is great. When we refresh, we are still staying on our about page. But here is one problem. When we uh, open new tab and try to go to another, uh, to the same route, we will not have permissions because session storage, it's only on this tab. But here is small hack. If we duplicate, it duplicates everything and we still have permissions. So take this into account when you develop depending on your security um, tasks. And that's it. Just remember, if you don't make mistakes, you don't make any progress. Have a great day. Bye.